do ensure to keep it TV47 in our subsequent bulletins. More details. Now, Sports Cabinet Secretary Kipchumba Murkomen has advised African leaders to address the needs of their youth as the issues in Kenya are common in many African countries. Addressing the media are the Young African Leaders Initiative Festival here in Nairobi. Murkomen highlighted how international stakeholders works to tackle youth unemployment, encourage civic participation, and ensure that all youth have the chance to reach their full potential. The Yali Festival event, which was aimed at, that, that aimed at amplifying the voices of young Africans in civic engagement, entrepreneurship, and public service, brought together different stakeholders who said African leaders should embrace giving their youth available opportunities to showcase their abilities. It's uh, something that we appreciate as the government of Kenya, partnering with the U.S. Uh, government. We believe that uh, we can borrow something from this program that as a government we can also uh, support other initiatives that are able to mentor young people to be able to be better leaders in different sectors in society. The United States Embassy provides uh, uh, leadership training and exchange programs for hundreds of Kenyans every year. The, the quality, the, the inspirational nature, the, 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 the things that these Kenyan um, students uh, and young adults can do is, is phenomenal. We, we love to partner with them to provide them these leadership opportunities, whether it's these exchanges that go to the United States. Uh, we've had so many young African leaders who've been taken to different uh, programs. We have the Mandela Washington Fellowship, which has taken people to the United States uh, to learn in different universities. Then we have the Young African Leadership Initiative uh, in the Yali Regional Leadership Center, which has also empowered like 6,000 leaders in business, public management, and civic leadership. Kenya is one of the countries that has been listed that we are, we are coming up with a lot of startups each and every year, and uh, we are very innovative in terms of, uh, we can see like, uh, uh, Man like Mandela Washington and RLC, they take people who will cover all the SDGs and uh, you can see that it has very creative people who have finished uh, their universities and have come here to create new products and create employment and create empowerment and be able to create um, you know, things that are able to help people in the community. All right, 14 minutes apart.